everyone, this is Kelly with C3 Workplace and today I'm going to be showing you how to use categories, uh, color-coded categories, on your calendar to help streamline your scheduling. Um, so as you'll see from my screen, I'm going to be using Outlook, but really most calendars have the capability to color code the categories. So you really can use this with whatever calendar you, you know, are using in your day to day. Uh, some reasons why we use it here at C3 Workplace and why we love it is uh, you're able to quickly prioritize tasks for the day at a glance. Uh, you can just look at your calendar and see what you've got going on and you know whether you need to go drive somewhere, you know whether you have calls or in-person meetings. So it's easy to sort of see everything uh, right off the bat. Uh, it's also really easy to hand off to someone else to handle your scheduling. You know, when you have a system in place, it really minimizes the learning curve for everyone involved. So everyone will sort of know right away whether the meetings are urgent or non-urgent. Um, there's leeway, you know, whether they can be moved or whether they need to stay put, that kind of thing. So um, first off, if you haven't already, what you would need to do is set up some categories. And you can do this in your main inbox. And again, like I said, I'm, I'm doing through Outlook. Um, so here is the main inbox and you want to be home and then you come over here where it says categorize and you click on the arrow you say I have some set up already click all categories and this will pop up and this is sort of where the control center for categories are so you'll see some are set up already so we can rename them we can delete them change the color and um, there's also shortcut keys if that's something that you're interested in um, so what we're going to do is just add a new one and there you put in the name and then you can choose what other whatever color you want or just keep they'll always give you an available color but you can choose whatever you want and there you go you say okay and again uh, if you're not aware you can also color, uh, categorize your emails depending on you know whether you needed to say urgent or something else um, by right clicking and hitting categorize and again you can just pick whatever you want but today we're just going to focus on the calendar. So the next step is to go over to your calendar and you'll see this week's pretty empty but next week we've got stuff here. Um, so you'll see um, we have we have the different colors which signify different um, categories so if you open it or if you you know right click and hit categorize you can see this is urgent means can't be moved um, the orange is a conference call and I've done two so you can do conference call and it's also urgent so you'll see on the calendar there's this little red box which means can't be moved um, so I'll show you how to do this and it, with this calendar you can either double click on the space where you want to add uh, an appointment or you come up to the left and you hit new appointment so here we have tutorial time and you'll see on the list is the new category we just made. So if you just click on that, now it's categorized and we'll say we want that for an hour. Save and close. And now it's on your calendar. And um, you'll know what it means um, you know, once you have your system set up. And another little hint that we like to do, because especially when you're first starting out, if you don't remember what color means what, it's you know easy to just look at this and be like, oh, just colors, I don't know what this means. So a little hint from us is we do the week. And you'll see we've created a key here on Sundays, because you know we usually just use this for work. So there's not going to be anything on Sunday for the most part. If you use Sundays, um, you know, you'll have to find another way to do this, but this is how we do it for our, our you know work week. Um, you create a key. So we know orange is a conference call, green means in person, blue is professional development, orange is travel time, red means urgent, so we know our dentist appointment can't be moved, <laughs> and we know that our call with Kelly can't be moved. And then yellow we have more non-urgent. So since we just added one, we want to either, like I said, either hit new appointment or double click. And then we'll just do tutorial time because that's what we called it. And we just do purple. And then because you want to be able to see this all the time, we suggest making it recurring. So we'll just have it every Sunday, hit OK, save and close. And there you go. Now you know what purple means. And if you go weeks from now, you'll see because you have the recurrence, it's always here. So if you have somebody else scheduling your calendar, you'll always have this reference point for when um, 
you know, you're looking at your calendar and everyone will know what everything means. And again, these are just examples. Um, you really categorize whatever makes the most sense to you and for you um, in your business and your daily life. So that is our tutorial on color coding your calendar to streamline your scheduling. We hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.